which one must be the best board by comparing these two boards which one must be the best board can anyone say which one is the best board i don't think so because these two circuits are best in their own ways in their dedicated circuits these two are power amplifier boards this is a class a b board here there is a class d board and also here there is a class a board how can we compare these three boards to find out the best one is it possible or is there any way if it is possible then pause the video and comment below which board is the best one and why that board is the best now let me tell you that i cannot say which one is the best board this is a class ab board and this board is the best circuit means it's a rod elliot circuit that's the best circuit uh, in between the class ab circuits and there are more brilliant circuits out there so is that circuit better than this circuit that's not possible we cannot compare like that do you know why because i told you before each circuits are better at their own dedicated circuits and why i say that is this is a class a b board and this board is i think is almost 70 percent efficient that means if it's running at a hundred watts power supply we can only get a 70 percent of that output of that hundred watts power supply so the output must be 70 watts at that power from this board by consuming that power if you are building a 500 watt stereo or a thousand watts left and right stereo or two channel amplifier then this board must be the best because it's budget friendly more efficient and almost better performing better performing than a class a board so here there is a class a board from this board we will get 40 watts of power and most of you must have heard about class a amplifier circuits that they are not at all efficient but they are the best amplifier available in the whole world not better than the tube amplifier i'm not comparing with that so this one is the best budget friendly amplifier board that is available and the way i say the best is the performance the detailing the best clarity output that we can get only from a class a amplifier and it's not at all efficient because it's consuming the 70 percent almost 70 to 75 percent of the power so if you need a 30 watts output from a class a amplifier you need to give a hundred watts of power to this board and it will consume that 70 percent 70 percent of that power and give the output to 30 watts so this circuit is meant for best clarity and if the power consumption is high then if there is no issue then this board this board is the best i recommend this board to every one of you because if you are uh, if you are interested in listening the best sound output from your from your device then a class a amplifier is the best but if you are worried about the power consumption the cooling issues and all those things then the class ab must be the best choice so that board the class a board is best at that situation at that type of circuit as per my understanding at the heavy output circuits and budget friendly circuits class a b amplifiers are best and here comes the next one this is the class d amplifier it's a 100 watts amplifier and the efficiency of this board is almost 90 percent so if we need a 90 watts of power output then we need to give this board a 100 watts of power it will consume only 10 percent and delivers 90 percent of the output so i usually use I, in the previous video also i told you about that that i usually used to select class d boards for subwoofers subwoofer amplifiers subwoofer is more power consuming so we need more efficiency at that circuit at that power rail so the best way is the class d boards if you are considering about almost the best performance and powerful output from a dedicated power supply then the class a b board must be the best so how can i recommend the best board so i made this video because there are too many comments in my previous videos on my other tech channel which board is the best which board should i buy where will i get the best board 
that's the comment it's not possible for me and the person who wrote the comment the way he commented is wrong then the question is relevant that which board is best for for such speakers for certain power supplies for certain circuits for a 100 watts speaker for a four rooms speaker or such questions are relevant so we can recommend the best board for that uh, and we need to consider the power the budget and everything else then only we can recommend a best board and that may not be the best board that must be the best available only there may be brilliant boards available out there so that's just one of my answer to the question to the comment posted by the viewers there are so many comments asking about which one is the best board so this is the answer so if you are trying to build an amplifier and if you're confused which board should i buy then please specify which speakers what uh, what are the specification of those speakers that you are going to use and what is the power supply how much is the power supply what's the watts then only anyone can recommend you the best board available in the market so keep in mind that whatever power board you are selecting it directly affect the power supply it will consume the power as per the circuit here are one of my recommendation about what type of power supply must be the best for amplifiers please hit the like button and go and watch that video